Hi everyone, I hope you're well. So it's currently Sunday evening and I'm with Luke and we've just got to the Traff Centre. It's actually the first time Luke has ever been to the Traff Centre. How yes, exciting. Uh, he was like, is there much parking? If you've been to the Traff Centre, you know there's plenty of parking. <laughs> um, but we're actually meant to be at KSI tonight, but it got cancelled. So we've come to some come to the Traff Centre instead and we're gonna go to Po Po for food and then go watch Jackass Forever. Jackass Forever at the cinema, which should be a good night. But yeah, that's what we're currently up to. I've never ever seen them red door shut, that's so weird. This is uh, Chinatown here. Ooh. You're not. <laughs> There's the menu that we're looking at before. Me and Luke have just sat down in Tampopo. We've already decided what we want. Uh, we're going to share the edamame. Then I'm going to have the tofu sticky wings. I'm going to have the chicken satay. And you're going to have the satay chicken. And then for main, I'm going to have the Singaporean curry and Luke's going to have the katsu curry with sweet potato. Yeah, chicken. With chicken. And I'm gonna oh. add some udon noodles and yeah. a boiled egg. Lovely. Just try it. And then to drink. the drink, I'm going to have the elderflower sparkling cordial and Luke's going to have homemade still lemonade. Lovely. So our starters have arrived. My uh, tofu chicken wings. They're the marmy with um, sea salt. Taste test. Oh. Look at that. It's so hot. <laughs> How is it though? Was it too hot? It's just scalding my mouth. And then Luke, what have you got? Chicken satay. Mm -hmm. That looks unreal. Oh, it's, it's steaming my phone up. I want to try one. The outside of it is really hard. I thought you ate the whole thing. Um, Do you know what I mean? Might have to Google that. Yeah. Go for it without any of the sauce on. Yep. Really nice. Nice. Yeah. The prime sauce. With the sauce. How is it? Your salad looks unreal. It's really good. You can have is that. It? Mm -hmm. I'll let you know how mine is. So we've learned that you pop the beans into your mouth and you don't eat the skin. So you learn something new every day. Very really nice. Good. So our mains have arrived. Luke's got the katsu, chicken katsu curry with a fried boiled egg, yeah. some udon noodles, and then here's my curry. I look, Luke, have you noticed the rice? Yeah, mine was oh, yeah. similar to it collapsed. Um, it. But yeah, it's got tofu and vegetables in there, and then we're still picking up our edamame, which are really nice. Stop filming. <laughs> Action. Um, so what drink have you got? Gone for a little. Can't beat a little. Oh, is my shoelace? No, no. felt undone. Pineapple and grapefruit. Oh, thanks for drink. sharing. <laughs> so me and Luke finished at Tampopo and now we're going to cinema to watch Jackass Forever. Are you excited? I am. Okay, I need Hannah. to hold on to you. I feel like I'm going to fall. I'll hold my hand. Hold my hand. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm excited. It's only an hour and a half as well, which is pretty decent. Um, which is I've got to travel back to Stoke yeah, uh, <laughs> against the strength of units. What? Unit? Unit? <laughs> unit? We said unit? Like unit of a wind. Anyway, we'll let you know how the film is afterwards. So, the look at the height difference. I'm like, oh. um, so we've just come out of the cinema. Luke, what did you think of the film? I really enjoyed it. Yeah, it was funny, wasn't it? It very much rolled back the years. Yeah. Of 
growing up watching Jackass. You know what I was thinking? I've, I, don't th- I think I've only ever watched Jackass with you. You watched one or two. Yeah. You know, you haven't seen all of them. No. Um, so that was nice. Yeah. But I thought, you know, the bit, I was really laughing at one point where I got a stitch. And it wasn't even like a bit that I was like meant to be funny. You know, it was the guy that... <laughs> The dad that goes, it's biting my arm. Oh. Honestly, that just killed me. <laughs> I was like, that is only something like, like you would say, it's biting my arm. <laughs> but yeah, I really enjoyed it. It wasn't like, I feel like when, we, when I've watched the movie in the past, I felt mm. sick because they're really gruesome. But I did today, so that's good. I enjoyed it. It went by fast. It, it keeps you like, you don't get bored, do you? It's, 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 it's constant. Thing, yeah. Though. So that's good. The starting was really good as well. I was like, oh my God, I feel like I'm watching a film. There's a lot of willies, I saw a lot of willies. Yeah. Thought, so. Lots of the new cast members are quite good. I thought, uh, I think his name was Poopies. Mm. He was the best new one. I can't remember the names, there's a lot of people. But yeah, I did really enjoy it. Well, we're heading back to the car now. We'll drive back and then Luke's got <laughs> to drive back to Stoke tonight. Yeah, for work Oh my God, morning. I'm not envy of you. Oh, are you getting that chocolate bar? No. You're not getting it? So you don't have to eat it today. Shall yeah. we see how much it is? I'm gonna get it. Okay. <laughs> we were gonna get a Snickers bar. Luke was gonna get a Snickers bar, and I was gonna get the Love Raw sort of caramel. Luke was gonna get that, and I was gonna get that one. I'm gonna see how much it is. Four, one, two. Oh, it's the app. Then we won't get it because you didn't get the app. One pound ten. That's not it, is it? Uh, no, it's showing that, but it's 4112. So it's four, no, it's 409. No, I was talking about you. Oh, right. I've seen how much it was. And then 4110. That's more expensive than yours. Bloody hell. What a con. Right, let's go. We'll get it up to We've just got back, and Luke is in his car. He's about to go. So I'll wait and uh, wave goodbye to him. Sad. I'll see you Thursday. <laughs> oh my god, it's so windy. It was hailing a minute ago. <sighs> I'll stand here like I <laughs> went with a nana, waves goodbye, always off. We're off. Tuesday, it's currently 20 past 12 and I've actually had a really chilled morning and I've really enjoyed it. I woke up and I was just so tired so I've just been in bed watching Peaky Blinders because I can't remember if I've watched the last season or not because the new series is coming out on Sunday which I'm so excited about. Um, so I actually had watched the last series but I don't know if I'd finished it, season 5, I don't know if I finished it but I've got one more episode left. But it's been good to like refresh my mind anyway. So that's what I've been doing this morning. But I'm just about to head out to the post office. But I also might take my camera with me and do day three on my photography challenge where I go out, take photos uh, and show my best ones on TikTok. So I might do that. Um, I just don't want it to rain. So yeah, but I want this to come on because I just sold a pair of shoes on Depop and um i had them in a box already that's what like, i stored them in and what i do is whenever i order anything online i always keep the bags so then when i sell items for example these shoes i then have a bag and i don't have to buy my own which just can save money so i thought i'd just mention that um for people that if they ever sell anything then it's a good little uh tip to have just i have like in my wardrobe in my bedroom i just have bags um that if i sell anything i can use so yeah it's really handy or if you buy something off someone else and the bag's good enough to then keep just yeah so i obviously ordered off new look and kept the bag it's really handy especially because like this is a big box but yeah there's a little slit there that i'm just going to cover with sellotape and then yeah head down really happy i sold these i'm not worn these i've barely ever wore these shoes they're 
I should have showed you them before I box them up, but they're like a pair of kickers. And they're just not really my style. Um, so very happy I sold them. But yeah, so I'm gonna go do that and then we'll see. So it's now Wednesday, Tuesday, it's Tuesday. No, what day is it? Yeah, it's Tuesday. <laughs> and it's currently almost three o'clock and I've just been filming some TikToks um, and I've just got my outfit ready for tonight. So tonight I'm going to a red carpet press night. Mm -hmm. Check me out with my friend Jay, who I went to see Mel C with last week. We're gonna go watch Fatal Attraction, which I'm really excited about. It's featuring Kim Marsh, Michelle from Coronet Street, if you used to watch it. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna show you my outfit because I absolutely love it. I'm so happy with it. I had no idea what to wear. And I thought, well, maybe I took this out of my um, boot on my car yesterday finally after so long and i was happy maybe that with well, as you can see my black skirt and my idea came to life and i like it a lot so here it is because i know i wanted to wear my blazer i thought just the lilac top would go nice with it then there's my black skirt then i put this belt on which has a chain here because i thought that would like Make it a bit edgy, you know what I mean? And then my black boots from ASOS, I wear these all the time. And then because my belt was silver, I put on this silver necklace, but my rings are still gold because these are my favorite. I really, really like this outfit a lot. Other good news is that the other day from Vinted, I bought Saturday by Megan Ella B, like high neck top, and it's ready for me to go pick up just from a local shop. So I might get changed, go walk there, pick that up. Um, and then I don't need to film the reel on me trying that today or wait till tomorrow and do that because I do need to sort my phone out. Um, basically, I got a new phone recently and I need to sort out my old one because my dad's having it and I haven't done it yet. I'm a bad daughter, I know. Um, and my dad will be watching this. So hopefully by the time this is up, it's, that phone is all sorted and he is now using it. <laughs> Maybe even watching this video on it. But yeah, so I don't know which one to do, but I will go pick up the top today because it's really nice weather actually. It's blue skies, sun shining, a lot different from the last few days. So I'm going to take advantage of that. It's a nice little walk, not too far. And yeah, but I think I might get changed because I don't know if I can be asked to walk in this because what time will I leave tonight? Um, yeah, I might get changed. I'm really really excited for tonight like i said i've never been to like a press night and then red carpet it's gonna be good i'm gonna meet jay beforehand for a drink so that'd be nice so i'm all ready to go out uh put my outfit back on i end up getting changed going to the post office come back uh upload my tiktok and and then getting dressed again and yeah i really like my outfit i'm really excited tonight i'll try and look, film little bits while i'm there um we'll see how i get on but yeah should be a good night So I've arrived and I'm just waiting for Jay. You're getting a low, uh, an ugly low, <laughs> low angle because there's a lot of people around. But yeah, just wait for Jay. But I've arrived and I'm excited. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm inside. <laughs> it's about to start. <laughs> so it's now. Um, why do I always forget what day of the week it is? It's now Wednesday and I'm just about to do my makeup and get ready. Um, I did a workout this morning. It was really good. Um, I just like follow a YouTube video. I did a new one today though from the same people but a different workout and it was good. It's half an hour long. Normally I do the 20 minute one but I was like oh I'll do 30 minutes today and it's good. Um, <laughs> my leg is already like you know when you walk and it just like gives way yeah it's already doing that i'm gonna do my makeup i'm hoping my i feel like i've got really bad bags because i'm just struggling to sleep at the moment which is not the best hopefully makeup will sort this out oh what am i gonna do i'm gonna film a tiktok of course and i'm gonna film an instagram reel then i want to put my nails some point today maybe lilac it was next to me but i do like lilac a lot yeah i'll talk about thingy later on as well last night because it was really really good i'll chat about that once i've got some stuff done <laughs> and i look a bit more presentable honestly i could just eat this i mean you can eat it quick sugar 
But, oh, it's so nice. I mean, I lick all the bits off my lips and yeah but i'm just about to do makeup and watch this is going to hurt honestly i don't know if i mentioned it already but um well i know i haven't mentioned that two of my favorite books have recently became tv shows oh my god like what did i deserve to get that what did i do to be, what did i do to deserve that <laughs> um because so i'm starting what i've been watching this is going to hurt while i've been doing my makeup the last few days i'm on episode three yeah just started episode three it's really good and then conversations with friends which because i've got both of my books here conversations with friends where's this gonna hurt oh i don't know oh i think my mum might have it i think i gave it to my mum better get that back but oh what they are such good books so i've just warmed my tea up and yesterday my mum made a really nice homemade lasagna so i've just got some now with salad honestly this is amazing and i'm so excited so oh ed you gonna be in the shot oh there he is <laughs> handsome yeah he's so stiff <laughs> oh right so there you go you look said hi so it's now 10 to 10 no 5 to 10 and i'm just about to like get ready for bed i'm just gonna sit in bed there's this film that i've wanted to watch the, like the last two nights but i've not actually been in the mood for it probably won't watch it tonight either but i thought i'll just sit down and um I'll show you what i got i can't remember if i said i think i did say that uh, i was meeting my friend tonight at the pub um we went for a drink it was really nice and we actually haven't seen each other since start of november so we exchanged presents um i gave her, her christmas present and she gave me like my birthday christmas present so i thought i'd just show you because honestly i love every single thing danielle got me so danielle if you are watching thank you again because you know me so well you smashed it i love it all one thing i've already ate it was this nomo bunny filled with cookie dough oh my god i love cookie dough and it was incredible definitely recommend and actually for the whole thing it was 139 calories 169 which i actually think is pretty decent so i had that then i got a bottle of prosecco I absolutely love this i might make that into um like a have like a bougie day have like a real bougie day and start off with what's it called when you put it with Books fizz, that's it. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I got some, I absolutely love candy kittens, and she got me blood orange and pomegranate, which I've never seen before. So I'm really excited to try them. I love the packaging actually. Then, okay, then I've got a candle, which is in, it's in the, um, it's called Mood. So I don't know if it like sets the mood, but it's quite cool. It's like a square. I think that's really, really cool. So I'll put that on a little dish, light that up. I feel like because of the colour, I'm assuming it'll set the mood. Then, oh, I don't know what to show you because oh my god. Um, I'll show you these. I've wanted these for so long. Oh, sneak peek. I've wanted these for so long. So they're like uh makeup remover pads. So I think you can either do it like use this instead of flannel, or use this with like, you know, like uh you have like them pads, um that you get from like Primark and that and then you just throw away afterwards that you use to like you know like missile is it missile water and um, you use this instead and then what you do is once you've used them used them once you use them you put them in this bag which is so cool and then you just throw the bag with all the pads in in the wash and you can reuse them so it's really good for the environment so i absolutely love these because i've worked with them for so long and i finally got them then oh, okay i'll show you honestly i want to show you my fit like said the best one to last but they're all amazing so i can't um so this is not actually in order um but <laughs> i got this book it says she believed she could so she did uplifting quotes from awesome women of color honestly i like briefly skimmed through it and the quotes i was like this is what i need honestly right now in life this is what i need let me let me pick you one
What really fulfills me is getting out of my comfort zone, taking chances. And your right and left feet don't move in unison, but they still move forward together. Very nice. Um, so I really like that and I need that. That's going to stay by my bed. And then, oh my God, I love this. So I absolutely love iced tea. And now it's coming up to spring and summer. The seasons of iced tea. No, not iced tea, iced coffee. Oh my God. You can tell it's 10 o'clock. And uh, I got this. So it's like a reusable Costa cup with like caramel, what do you call it? Syrup, flavouring. So my iced coffees are going to taste absolutely incredible. Like I'm coming for you, Costa. I'm going to outdo you. But honestly, oh, my iced coffees are going to be amazing. So yeah, I love that. I'm just going to be walking around obsessed and yeah honestly i just love everything i'm so lucky so grateful thank you once again danielle i love it all and that's going on my bed i'm gonna use them tonight <laughs> we had a really good night at the pub it was just so nice to catch up and yeah i'm now gonna get ready for bed so <gasps> i'll see you tomorrow because tomorrow luke's coming over and we're gonna go watch davy in the evening and i'm so excited oh my god it's gonna be sick my friend angel went to the one in nottingham like last week and she said it was the best performance she's ever been to so i have got high expectations i had high expectations now my expectations are even higher and i feel like he's gonna absolutely smash it out of the park so really excited for that i've simply got an idea of what i want to wear so i've got to try it on tomorrow but yeah also i'm falling in love more and more with this t-shirt it's chef kiss <laughs> um but yeah i'm gonna tie my bed take my makeup off put my jams on and watch some netflix so it's now thursday and i've just finished doing a workout it was actually like because i did one yesterday i did like a half an hour workout yesterday and i just did a 20 minute one then and then oh my god i was like oh i'm just gonna try this like what do you call it a workout thing <laughs> it's really hard i only did like 10 on each side uh if that makes sense but reps reps i did 10 reps on each leg and it was really hard <laughs> i'm so excited for tonight i've been listening to dave i was listening to dave while i do my workout i did the same yesterday as well just moisturize my hands my hands are so dry like in between my fingers at the moment so i'm using this i got for christmas it's really really good i love it a lot so i've just been packing just wrote a well, I've just been applying for a job and Luke is about to arrive. I'm really excited to see him. Even though I saw him, what, one Sunday? Sunday? Sunday. It feels like it's been so long. So, yeah, really, really excited to see him. He should be walking down any minute. I'm really excited to see him. Let's see if he's on his way. Can't see him. Hmm. <laughs> so me and Luke are now in Manchester we're just heading for some food before we go to the arena um, I'm wanting what the pitter Luke doesn't want to go so he's going to find somewhere on the way um, I'm really excited because what the pitter is so good and I've never had it before so yeah so we've ended up actually going to Slim Chickens which have vegan food as well which is really good uh, I've got like vegan chicken tenders fries and a drink and Luke's got I've got normal chicken tenders some wings fries and a drink so yeah we'll let you know uh, when the food arrives Luke has never been to the Arnold before which is mental and this is the first time we've both been to Slim Chickens so the food has arrived this is mine it looks so good you even get garlic bread this is Luke's food and the wings have gone how were they incredible was it a good decision to go here unreal decision but yeah we're gonna tuck in and then head to the arena so we've arrived at the arena and we haven't actually missed anything yet because we thought we might have missed the start of the sport act but we haven't um this is first time luke's been to this arena it's going to be first recently. Um, but yeah, the support act is meant to be. Are you excited? I am. I am too, yeah. I 
I think it's meant to be a really good Show, performance. Yeah, like, like a spectacle. Yeah, so... What were we saying? Oh yeah, it's meant to be a really good performance and I'll show you uh, where we're sat because they're really good seats. So this is our view, so you'll obviously go there and there. I think that, like when he goes there, Luke, that's going to be class. Yeah. That's going to be so good. So yeah. So the concert is over, me and Luke are on our way back to mine and then we've still got a drive all the way to Stoke. It's yep. going to be a long night. We're both really thirsty, I really need a wee and the Met is one minute away. Yes. Luke, quick thoughts on Dave tonight. I thought it was excellent, he's a true showman. Um, it was one of the best spectacle performances that I've seen. Um, I really enjoyed it, I really enjoyed it, it's a great atmosphere. It was, I really enjoyed it too, but I'll go into more of it later when it's warm and I'm not tired either week. Oh, here it is. No, it's not. What's that sound? It is currently, oh my god, I haven't got a watch on, 20 past, about half one, 20 past one. And I'm not gonna lie, I've not really left this bed. Obviously, we got in really late last night. We arrived back at one and then got ready for bed. Um, so we didn't go to bed till really late. Then I woke up with Luke when he went off to work, made him breakfast, said goodbye to him. Then I went back to sleep and woke up at 12. So like, my phone going off. Oh, I've got a spot my neck. But I do think I really needed that sleep because, you know, when you just get like little signs that you're getting ill, like my throat was hurting the other day. I've got a spot on my tongue. And then there was another reason. I can't remember. So I'm really lucky to sit that sleep. And I haven't slept that well this week. And then I've just been like on my phone. Um, but I am gonna get up in a moment. I kind of fancy porridge. So I think I'm gonna have that. Tonight I'm off out with a friend and some of her friends. So that should be really good. Um, we're going to spoons and then we're going to sugar mill, which I've never been to sugar mill before. So really excited for that. I've got my outfit planned. So of course I'll film a TikTok. But yeah, it's a nice relaxed friday so far i'm really enjoying it but yeah i think i'm gonna move from the sofa move from the bed to the sofa now make some breakfast mm, have a cup of tea and watch 22 kids is counting i think i mentioned this in like almost every one of my videos i'm gonna watch 22 kids and counting i mean at one point i'm gonna i can't say that because you know the series will end which will be very sad, but yeah, uh, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm about to do a workout because I was actually going to start doing my makeup. Oh shit. I was going to start doing my makeup for today, or for this evening. But then I thought, because I'm going out tonight, tomorrow I won't have time in the morning to do a workout. And I probably won't do one when I get back from uh, Vale. So... I'm going to do one now and have my rest day tomorrow and then do one Sunday. But I think this workout's going to be really hard because yesterday it was like challenging for some of the workouts. And I was using four kilograms of weights, so like two, four kilograms. And today I'm using five. So I'm up in the weight. Yeah, I'm not at a rest day yet. So should be interesting. Um, I might link below actually. The workout that I do, but I'll link it in the description in case you are interested at all. Uh, it is really good. I I think it's it's full body dumbbell workout uh, where it's no repeat, so that's quite cool. Like it's forty seconds of it's forty seconds of um, one workout, twenty seconds rest, and then you move to a different one, and then there's five. Like, no, four, like, segments. I put my nail. There's four segments, and I think that's, like, different, eight, like, targets, different parts of your body. So, 
Yeah, I'm gonna do that now. I might, I'll do it. I'll, um, I'll do a time lapse of some of it. So yeah, let's go. tried to use the same weights where like they the two people in the video decreased their weights um so in the end i decreased mine but i felt defeated um, i used some 5k and then some 2k 2k is like you lift it it's like you're lifting nothing but some i just could do with 5k my lips are all dry but yeah i'm off i'm just waiting for my dad now i'm off to go watch veil I'm also waiting on Luke to tell me if I can eat at the ground or if I need to eat here because I'm starving. And that's it. And then tonight, what am I going to do tonight? I don't know. We'll see. Watch. <laughs> 
What's your score prediction for the rest of the game? I would, I would like to see two more goals for the four I'd like that too. I'm keeping the hat on because it's pretty cold but I'm just making tea for me and Luke it's going well turn the mountain uh, hob on so nothing was cooking uh, but we're, we're on track now sausages are in the um, oven I forgot to defrost them so also going well also I need to quickly just tidy Miles and Dan if you're watching thanks a lot and now I'm having to tidy because um, Luke's the messy one I'm gonna do that. Let's do time lapse and we clean the kitchen. Quality content here. So for dinner tonight, we're having these plant pioneers. Six Cumberland shroom dots. I never had these before, but we're gonna um cooking them and cutting them up and putting them in pasta. Also, I never know how much pasta to make, and I feel like I'm not made enough, but then it'll probably end up out being that I've made too much. But I don't know, I feel like I'm not done enough. We'll have to see. But yeah, I'll let you know how these are. They look nice. Final thing, this is mine with my cheese on, and then Luke's got this grated hard cheese Italian style from HelloFresh. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty proud of myself. Oh, that looks funny. So it's now almost quarter to 11, and I've just been um, editing this video, and I thought I'd just come on and kind of wrap it up, because I'm gonna upload it tonight, ready for tomorrow morning. Um, firstly, the sausages. They were okay, but like nowhere near as good as Richmond sausages. So if you are like wanting to try a vegan sausage, definitely go for the uh, <laughs> definitely go for the Richmond sausages because they are so good. These were nice, but just not on that level. Secondly, the food at Slim Chickens was really, really good. Like my meal was so nice. You get like two dips as well. I liked one of them the one not as so much but yeah honestly I'd definitely recommend um and luke really liked his food but yeah i'm gonna i think i'm gonna upload this and while it's uploading run a bath because it's quite cold so i think that'd be really nice get a nice bubble bath i bought luke this light which i think i mentioned in the video but yeah put that on it really like it adds like a warm glow so that'll be nice so one more thing i just wanted to know is that i actually had this clip that i was umming and ahhing about adding in i edited it and then i've just now taken it out so <laughs> you won't see it but basically i just wanted to point out that like this video that you just watched if you have stayed this long thank you um might seem like my week has been amazing. Oh my god, it's great. Lee's living the best life, that sort of thing. It was such a really good week. I absolutely loved it. However, it's not like I'm living my best life. I'm living a great life. But just remember that like what you see isn't everything. Like I've had very down moments in the week where I've been really upset. I'm crying for no reason. I'm trying to just get on with my day but crying um but i don't want to share that because um honestly i like that clip that that i filmed i got upset in it and i watch it back on chat i can't i can't watch it i can't wait, let anyone else watch it but just know i feel like it's so easy for like social media for people if you look at someone's account or follow someone they look like they're living their best life but realistically they could be having such a shit time and 
yeah it's it's a mad one it it really is mad um like the way social media can portray someone's life so yeah just a little thingy because i did want to mention it but i was gonna i, I spoke about it in that clip but then i really just cringed at myself um so i thought i'd just mention it now if you're feeling shit at the moment don't worry i have too um you're not alone there are highs and lows in life and yeah so anyway i've rambled on Thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy. And I'll see you all next week. I think I might do another weekly vlog. I'm not sure yet. I actually haven't got much planned next week. So it could be a boring one. But we'll see. But I'll see you very soon anyway. So thank you for watching. Goodbye.